If your car ever breaks down, let me just tell you something. Don't ever pull it apart yourself. Because, reason why is they will not touch it if you've been there already. Which I didn't know. By the way, this was a new battery. This shit better still start, I'm telling you. Okay, so let me tell you people what's happened to this car. Alright? Behind that cam seal, or the cam gear right here, that orange o-ring looking thing, that's the, ca that's the cam seal, and that has uh, popped out when I was driving, and then what happened was, it um, started to leak a lot of oil, and then obviously what goes around it is the timing belt. So, as soon as the oil would have hit the car, and we had accelerated a bit further than normal it would have um, slipped a couple of teeth so hopefully this thing isn't out of timing by too much I think it's only like three or four teeth which is repairable I don't know hopefully the stents can hit the pistons and I think they do this here yeah. so let's see what he says yes so the mechanic was here and uh, I think he was here for about like two hours came like 220 bucks and we don't have good news for you because uh, we didn't um, we didn't really get much done. I understand he didn't uh, probably didn't have the right amount of tools or anything like that. But um, like me when you're a mechanic, right? You gotta bring the tools because you should know this shit. But anyways, Allah is the greatest, and um, I have the utmost faith in him that we will get this car back on the road running before Wednesday so I can sell it if the car isn't in any shape to be sold then I will not be selling the car because I'm not going to do anybody dirty like that because I'm not like that so this is the car it's like a license plate nothing special it was just supposed to be a daily and um now it turned out to be a headache. I did buy it for dirt cheap, but that's not the point. So let me just close this hood. Basically, what's happening is I gotta tow this car to the shop where he works so it can actually get it on the hoist. 
sorry for my filming, so we can get it on the hoist and um, actually, you know, work on it properly with the right tools and that sort of thing. So him being here cost me like 220 for nothing when I should have just taken it to him in the first place and we would have been sweet. It wouldn't have cost me an arm and a leg but now it's going to cost me both my legs. Um, yeah, I'm going to tow the car to his shop now and uh, hopefully I don't get messed around because I don't like to be messed around and I don't think anybody does. But he's a nice guy, he called the tow truck for me. He said he charges cheap because when you do it through them it's cheaper. So hopefully it's a hundred bucks because that's what he said. hundred bucks is still a lot of money but it doesn't matter. You know what I mean, money's money. Just um, when things fail on it, as is with any car, things get expensive. A few moments later. Tow truck's here and uh, literally like three hours later. So I'm trying to get this car sold. I don't even think I will, to be honest. Like, I don't know if this car will be fixed in time. It better be fucking fixed. Or, like, at least just get it back to one order, you know what I mean? Oh. Woo! Alright, right, guys. You trying to break shit? Um, yeah, so, five hours later, the tow truck came. We're gonna get, gonna head home. I don't know if maybe stop off, get some food, something, I don't know. We'll see. We'll see you in one, two, three. Just got back home. Kids are sleeping. They stay asleep. Shut your mouth. I feel like I'm the only one who wants to do this. Did you like the car? No, I didn't. <sighs> so there you go, people. That is how you put a kid to sleep. Hey boo. <laughs> what you making? I'm making a vegetarian pasta. Is this because we're trying to be healthy? Mm, I guess, but it's also because the meat out. Oh, but we have meat though. I don't know, a nigga who don't wash it. What are you doing? Just more water if you need. Does it not need any more water? Ah, oh, man. I'm so thirsty, I could drink this, man. Why does it smell like that? Can I drink that? Does it smell like bleach? Mm. Does halloumi? Is that halloumi? Yeah. Gross. 
You like halloo meat. You go eat my halloo meat. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> bro. Oh. Yeah, that's better. The lighting is better for sure. You just do it. <laughs> Surprise! <laughs> no, no, no! I'm holding the camera. I'm. I've, I've got shit in my pockets. So you do not want to do that. No, I've got shit in my baby. Up. You don't want to do that. <laughs> Trust me. Trust, Trust me. Take it out. What is it? It's my phone and shit. Take it out, lady. No. Take it out. My you nigga, you are messing all over the floor. What? Oh my word. Why? <laughs> are you gonna clean that up or? You clean it up. Nigga, you really need to clean that up. that's the end of today's vlog slash prank if you enjoyed this video hit the thumbs up button and don't forget to subscribe it's your boy nady and it's your girl l and we signing out peace, peace.